What is up, my Dova Kensuba fans? Welcome to another Elder Scrolls 5 Skyrim Special Edition walkthrough. And look at us. Say hello to my new companion next to me. Um, his name is uh, Friendall. And the only way you get to uh, get this guy to follow you you need to complete a certain quest uh, back at Riverwood and it has to do with him impressing a girl or I, I don't know I don't remember but who cares I have a I have a follower a companion next to me and this right guy on. this guy specializes in archery I'll show you what I know but Oh, I could upgrade some more. Okay, I can't. So, that sucks. That's too bad. So, let's go ahead. Keep doing some Dark Brotherhood missions, shall we? So, we need to talk to Muri. Guessing that's a girl's name. So, she's a Markath. Or Markarth. Sorry. So let's go over here and try to get there. As we get in there, I want to take the time to apologize for the last video I uploaded, which was a Retro Fridays video on Super Mario RPG. I personally believe my commentating was a little bit um, out of out of like line or bad but the reason why is because I am sick I had a sore throat last night and I'm feeling better which uh, which is good I took some medicine and so right now I just have a runny nose no no big deal so let's go ahead and get these enemies And we found... Oh shit, nice. So yeah, so I'm feeling better a little bit, not 100%, but I'm not going to let this uh, cold take me down to uh, make videos. Because I want to deliver some content to you guys. And I have an announcement to make at the end of the video, so let's go ahead and keep playing and stay with me. And now, I am here at Markarth. What the heck? What is going on? Everyone, stay back. The Markarth City Guard have this all under control. There are no force sworn here. Huh. We'll handle things from here. Move along. That man shouted something about the force sworn. I said move along. The force sworn are just a bunch of madmen. We have everything under control. Stay out of it. Do you? That's right. It isn't. Guns? Mm -hmm. A woman attacked right on the streets. Are you alright? Did you see what happened? Who in the hell is talking to me? Force one. Oh, it's that guy well, I hope right there. More peace in the future for what it's worth. Oh, I think you dropped this. Some kind of note. Looks important. Uh... Hmm? No. I was just getting some fresh air. I had one too many pints of mead at the Silver Blood Inn. Okay, so until next time. This just pretending. We'll handle things from here. Move along. I'll get that. Margaret. He he killed her. Right in front of me. Silver blood in. So that's where our next contract is for the Dark Brotherhood. 
Come on in. The Silver Blood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. And why are you looking at me like that? Hey, I knew it was a she. The Dark Brother. Oh, oh, I. My goodness, you're really here. The Black Sacrament. It actually worked. Obviously. <laughs> what I need is for Elaine Dufont to die. I want him hunted down and murdered like the dog he is. Ooh. Uh. Get to the point. I didn't know it when we were with each other, but Elaine is actually the leader of a band of cutthroats. Bandits. They're hmm. holed up in some old dwarven ruin. Raldbathar. It's near Windhelm. They use it as their base. It's where they stage their raids. I want you to go to that ruin, find Elaine Dufont, and kill him. I don't care about his friends. Do whatever you want with them. Jeez. Elaine has to die. All right. Excellent. Once Elaine is dead, I'll pay you. In gold. I've saved up a bit. I hope that'll do. Okay. Well, there is one more thing. If you're interested. I'm listening. If you can, I want you to kill someone else as well. You don't have to, not as part of our deal, but if you do, I'll pay you even more. It's Nilsine Shattershield in Windhelm. If Nilsine dies too, I'll make it worth your while. Okay. Make them all pay for what they've done to me. Alright, so... Two cube, uh... Alright, so two people I have to kill. Let's see how the city looks. About this house? No. Anyone seen entering or leaving? Any strange lights or unusual noises? It's a bad excuse. It's always. Do you know anything about this house? Seen anyone enter or leave? No. Seems no one in this city has. I'm with the Vigil of Stendar. We believe this house might have been used for Daedra worship, evil rites, and so forth. Do you need any help? I was actually just about to head on inside. It'd be good to have someone watch my back. Follow me and keep your eyes open. Daedra are powerful creatures and tricksters. Never know what you'll find. Oh, snap. Recently. But the people I asked say no one enters or leaves. Okay, Wait, so. Did you hear that? I think it came this way. There's a chest here. All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go first person. Uh. That's it. Something's inside the house. Come on, we're getting to the bottom of this. Come out. We know you're here. There's another door. See if you can get it open. Tendar's mercy! This isn't an ordinary Tedra. We have to get help. Weak. He is weak. You're strong. Crush him. You first. Come on. Let's go. Hmm. I can't get out. Get out of my head, Tedra. You will kill. You will kill or you will die. Well, I don't want to die either. I have a mission to do after. You yes, your reward is waiting for you, mortal. Further down. Okay. Be careful. So. A reward awaits us. Too bad that guy had to die. All he wanted to do was just to explore yes, the abandoned house. Further into the bowels. 
Uh... Oh. I have... So close. Your prize is waiting. Well, would you look at that? Oh. Fool. Did you think Molek Bal, the Lord of Domination, would so easily reward you? What do you see from that little cage? Speak! Uh... A mace? Rusted. Dry. There was a time when this mace dripped with the blood of the feeble and the worthless. But a Daedric Lord has his enemies, and my rival Boethia had her priest desecrate it, left it here to decay until you came. Uh, you want revenge on revenge. that? Revenge? No, I want submission. I want the priest who did this to bend his knee and give me his soul. He comes by to perform Boethia's insulting rites at my altar, but he's been missing. Captured and bound, left to rot. Save him. Let him perform his right one more time. And when he does, we will be waiting for him. Okay. Am I going to take the mace or... Okay, find a priest. I need a, to go outside. I really want that maze. Another mission to uh, complete. That's fine. That's the point of Skyrim. Get jacked up with missions. Okay. So is there enemies or not? I don't remember. I don't remember. There is. There is. There is. There is. It's up there. Nice. Nice kill. Look at that. There's another one up there. Okay. Good. There. They are down and out. Let's keep going up. And go inside. Steel arrow. Nice iron arrows. Alright. It's pretty strong. What was that? Not the best you can do. Do you? No. Got to protect this guy. That axe uppercut. Nice. Uh, solid Dwemer metal. Let's see if we can get nice one hit kill.
another one over there. Get this one. Oh, no. but he's getting hurt. Nice. It takes teamwork to get the job done. No wonder I killed him. This guy's wearing one of the most weakest armor sets in the whole damn game, I believe, in my opinion. And that is for armor. Let's get nice. Alright. Well, you must have all those annoying gods on your side. Whoever you are. Dead. Should have come here. Alan Dufont. Ah! The guy I wanted to see. Oh crap. That is nice. Gonna disenchant that a little bit later. So now let's go to Windhelm and kill the other guy. Okay, so it's just right there. Oh, that's her. The townsfolk call me captain because I used to be a sailor. What? Did you need something? Moiri? I can't believe my family trusted that backstabbing little strumpet. You tell her she's dead to us. You hear me? Dead! Someone's being attacked. This should be good. I'm getting out of here. Okay. Someone do Well, what news? Is Elaine? Yep. Thank you. That bastard got exactly what he deserved. And I heard about Nilsine. You have more than fulfilled your part of the bargain. Please, take this. As payment? and a symbol of my affection. I'll never forget you. Thank you again for resolving my problem. Miri's ring. Wonder what that ring. Wah. Potions, really? Not too happy. Ah, you're back. So, how went your first real con? Of course, dear, of course. And from what my little ravens tell me, you handled yourself quite well. Now, I need your assistance with a matter of a more personal nature. Okay. It's Cicero. Ever since he arrived, his behavior's been... Well, erratic would be an understatement. I do believe he is truly mad, but it's worse than that. He's taken to locking himself in the Night Mother's chamber and talking to someone in hushed but frantic tones. Who is he speaking with? What are they planning? I fear treachery. Mm. Maybe so. 
But healthy paranoia has saved this sanctuary before, and my gut's telling me that demented little fool is up to something. Dear brother, I need you to steal into that chamber and eavesdrop on their meeting. It'll be no use clinging to the shadows. They'll see you for sure. No, you need a hiding place. Somewhere they'd never think to look. Like inside the Night Mother's coffin. <laughs> uh, okay. No objections then? Good. Go now, before they meet, and report back to me with whatever you learn. Alright, so let's go ahead and do the next mission then. Go, quickly. Hide in the coffin before Cicero and the traitor meet. Open it. Nice. And we go in. Yes. <laughs> yes. Alone. <laughs> Sweet solitude. No one will hear us. Disturb us. Everything is going according to plan. The others, I've spoken to them, and they're coming around, I know it. The wizard Festus Crex, <laughs> perhaps even the Argonian, and the Unchild. What about you, hmm? Have you... have you spoken to anyone? No? No, of course not. I do the talking, the stalking, the seeing, and the saying. And what do you do? Hmm? Nothing! Not... not that I'm angry. What the oh, heck? never. Cicero understands. <laughs> Cicero always understands. And obeys. You will talk when you're ready, won't you? Won't you? Sweet night, mother. Poor Cicero. Dear Cicero. Such a humble servant. But he will never hear my voice. For he is not the listener. Oh, but how can I defend you? How can I exert your will if you will not speak to anyone? Oh, but I will speak. I will speak to you. For you are the one. Yes, you. You who shares my iron tomb. Who warms my ancient bones. I give you this task. Journey to Wallen Road. Speak with Armand Mortier. Poor Cicero has failed you. Poor Cicero is sorry, sweet mother. I've tried so I'm guessing the mother hard, talked to but me. Just can't find the listener. Tell Cicero the time has come. Tell him the words he has been waiting for all these years. Darkness rises when silence dies. What? What treachery? Defiler! Debaser and defiler! You have violated the sanctity of the Night Mother's coffin! Explain yourself! Speak, worm! She spoke to you? Yep. More treachery. More trickery and deceit! You lie! The Night Mother speaks only to the listener! 
and there is no listener. Hmm. She. She said that. Yep. She said those words. Yep. To you. Darkness rises when silence dies. Yep. But those are the words, the binding words, written in the keeping tomes. The signal so I would know. Mother's only way of talking to sweet Cicero. Then it's true. She's back. Our lady is back. What the heck? She has chosen a listener. <laughs> she has chosen you. <laughs> All hail the listener. <laughs> My Sithis, this ends now. Back away, fool. Whatever you've been planning is over. Are you all right? I heard the commotion. Who was Cicero talking to? Where's the accomplice? Reveal yourself, traitor. I spoke only to the Night Mother. I spoke to the Night Mother, but she didn't speak to me. Oh, no! She spoke only to him, to the listener. What? The listener? What are you going on about? What is this lunacy? Ay, ay. It's true! It's true! The Night Mother has spoken! The silence has been broken! <laughs> this guy is nuts. The has been chosen! When I heard Cicero screaming, I knew you'd been discovered. I feared the worst. Are you alright? Yup. Then what in Sithis' name is going on? Cicero spoke to the Night Mother, but she spoke to you? Is this just more of the fool's rambling? It's true. What? So Cicero wasn't talking to anyone else. Just the Night Mother's body? And the Night Mother, who, according to everything we know, will only speak to the person chosen as listener, just spoke. Right now. To you? Yep. My Sithis. And? What did she say? Uh, yeah. Amand Motier? I have no idea who that is, but Valenrood, that I have heard of, and I know where it is. Hmm. No. No. Listen, I don't know what's going on here, but you take your orders from me. Are we clear on that? The what Night the Mother heck? may have spoken to you, but I am still the leader of this family. I will not have my authority so easily dismissed. I... I need time to think about all this. Go see Nazir. Do some work for him. I'll find you when I'm ready to discuss the matter further. Receive a side, side contract from Nazir. This is all just too much too fast. Go get some work from Nazir. I need time. All right. That's crazy. Does death not come to us all? Is it not a certain Still here. I am What's the matter? Can't handle what I'm throwing your way? Part in a being's inevitable end. What are your thoughts? I don't like mimes, minstrels, thespians, acrobats, jugglers, troubadours, or tumblers. Flutists give me a headache. I particularly hate jesters. As a rule, I'm also not crazy about the corpses of old women. For the Night Mother, I'll make an exception. But Astrid is the only mistress I serve. Okay. Uh... Well then, your timing couldn't be better. As it turns out, I've got two new contracts. One rather easy assignment, and another that should prove quite a challenge. Your first target is an orc bard named Lurbuk. The other is a vampire by the name of Hearn. Happy hunting. I'm guessing the vampire is uh Happy hunting. The hard one maybe.
Oh. All right. So let's let's keep going. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode right here. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for some more Skyrim content. And like always, this has been Dova Ken Super serving you with awesome content and I will see you on the next episode all right guys so here is the announcement on December 17th Saturday game night Sundays will be hosting a clash royale tournament called clash and destroy if you guys wish to participate all you got to do is go to the website www.gamenightsundays.com and buy your ticket for just ten dollars and if you guys cannot make it, all you got to do is go to the Game Night Sunday's YouTube channel and you guys can see it live. And yes, it will be streaming live on their channel or you could just go to their website, sign up for a profile account. It's free and you, you can see it there. And it will really mean a lot to Game Night Sunday's if you guys make it or subscribe to their channel to just see the tournament. And yes, I will be there. I'm, I am going to be participating. And hopefully I win this thing. Because um, this tournament will be the last tournament of the year for Game Night Sundays. As next year they're going to announce their tournament slate of 2017. So hopefully you guys, uh, again, can make it. Or you can either subscribe and watch the tournament. Thank you guys and have a good day.